take me away from him? I have a plan for us. Marry me, Camille. Marry me. How long? Tell me I am your only lover. The only one. I think what was the most exciting thing for me about it was the fact that it's a, it was Harriet Warner, the writer and um, showrunner, and a lot of and female directors. And I really like the idea of us seeing his historical moments reimagined from yeah. you know the eyes of women because it was an era where women have been kind of silenced or written out of history and um, used as almost as props, like as wives or some sort of like uh, accessory. And I think that in this show, in this perception of this show, it shows that it's much more complex and layered and um, much more powerful than maybe what society would have liked to believe in the time. And what's always interesting about talking about history is that, you know, as I know, I know as a mother of two children that you are, that, and both of my daughters, they are born with like a type a, a character and it doesn't matter whether society says you need to be submissive you need to be this you're still born as a woman with a character i know yeah. that i i'm quite alpha as a person and i cannot imagine that in that era there weren't women who were born with an alpha personality so i think it's really interesting to like revisit history which is other, like portrayed women otherwise as like all submissive or all, you know, adhering to the rules and stuff like that. And I think that there was women are more complex and they always have been. And so it's great to work on a project where that's explored. My love for you is the only thing I am sure of. Then what would you give to have me back? Everything. She is not very nice. She is a bit like a modern version. A modern version of her would be like a social media influencer from TikTok. She's really shallow. She affects other people's opinions of like fashion and gossip. And she's not very nice. She's very self-obsessed and narcissistic. Yeah. And she only likes friends who tell her that what she wants to hear. She's she likes sick of bands. And um, I wouldn't be friends with her. <laughs> She's horrible. <laughs> well, it was um, quite funny because I just had a baby four months before. Oh. Hmm. So I was breastfeeding and I was like in this corset. And I had breasts that don't really exist anymore. Yeah. They're not there. I was trying to do a sex scene with um, the, the character that plays Balmore. I was in a sex scene with him and um, it wasn't... I didn't feel very sexy. I was four months after having a caesarean. It was like the most unsexual feeling ever and I had to pretend that I was really into it. Your dignity. You can't win against that sort of power. You know how dangerous this is.